Hey everyone, Tobias here. Welcome to another Nikkei video. So, to the devs of Nikkei, um, shift up or Tencent, whoever's watching this video right now because I'm sending it to the devs directly, okay? I just want you to understand, first of all, this is a fantastic skin, all right? The skin is really good. I mean, my God, I'm almost distracted every time I look at it. You've done some great things for the half anniversary. The Overzone event was definitely the highlight and one of the best event I've ever played across all of the gachas. The half anniversary rewards were fantastic. Honestly, it was better than some of the other games full anniversaries. But, but, okay, but now you're turning back on us and giving us this luxury bunny skin which is honestly one of the best skins you've ever released but putting it behind this system i don't think most people will be happy with all right so here's my thought i think it's completely fine for you to want to monetize this top tier skin but for a 60 dollars skin because most people will pay will have to pay 60 dollars to get this skin okay but for a 60 dollars skin i was hoping a new burst animation okay not that i can just put in the lobby but for a complete new burst animation for a new voice line attack pose and what i mean by attack pose is uh, you don't just copy the normal rupees attack pose okay look it's this is the exact same but just reskinned i want a brand new attack pose okay brand new attack pose a different gun please and most importantly, you gotta give us more, like a Bond story or something. If you're gonna give us a $60 skin, which is a, the price of more than a AAA game nowadays, I think it's fair for us to expect a lot. Okay, a lot. But first and foremost, I don't think the skin should be made $60. Because the breakdown is that a whale, if you make the gotcha pool attractive enough all right if the rewards are good enough the whale is going to empty this all right i'm speaking from a, a whale perspective i'm going to empty this entire gotcha pool even after i get the skin if the reward here is good enough all right so you should make it so everyone gets uh, one free pool is not it at least like five okay you can dilute the pool a tiny bit but give at least five and make it so that it's one percent just like your pilgrims for the skin and it's not after the fifth pull that you can start pulling it make it so that the people can actually luck sack it and then for your remaining prices you have the rocks here i would pay for it those rocks you're selling for a lot anyways right put the vouchers in put the manufacturing put the rocks put the skill manual i will pay for everything in here I will go the full distance. You don't have to make this this expensive to just get the skin. And for God's sakes, I think you can make it pullable with gems. Even if you make the gem equivalent more expensive. All right. Because you've got Summer Limited coming up. You've got Near Collab coming up. This would actually be a fantastic way to drain people's gem reserve. Okay, you can drain people's dream reserve this way so that when the collab comes or when a super meta come, a unit comes, they will top up. They will buy the mission pass. They will buy whatever efficient gem packages are available. They will top up. So make it like at least gem pullable, even if it's expensive. But to sell the skin completely behind $50 to $60 it's uh, this is not it this is not it okay there is definitely a way to monetize it and have people be happy with it if you look at it right now our mission pass is the standard right it's a 20 dollars pass you get a really sick skin the viper skin is fantastic and you get a lot of pulls and gems you get a lot of pulls and gems I think if you're going to do the gacha, this would be the only skin that people can pull with gems. Okay. This should be the only skin that people can pull with gems. 
some people are saying charge gems only i'd say i would not make it charge gems only you should be able to pull with normal gems you should be able to pull it with normal gems because i know you, the point of this is trying to make money right you're obviously not going to make it completely free i understand that i mean it's the probably one of the highest quality skins in this game so far but i don't think you should make it behind 60 dollars because right now people are complaining if you look at the discord people are complaining um that you they want ways to put to get skins that are not paid skins only okay not paid skins only you've got a lot of players that have broken their free to play status with the mission pass and whatnot okay so make this skin gacha better cheaper and if you want to drain people's gems you can drain it with the free gems all right uh i know some people will say oh my god you should make it like super free to play friendly uh no that's that's not gonna happen okay that's just not gonna happen um we're trying to find the middle ground here we are trying to find the middle ground here but anyhow uh that is my feedback i hope you share it with the team okay I mean, we all love the game. Your half anniversary was fantastic. Uh, don't don't turn it, don't turn it down like this. Okay, don't turn it down like this. And I, I expect a full burst animation fix. Like, yeah. Oh God. Okay. I I have nothing to say now. I have nothing to say now. <laughs> yeah. Bye.